One of the main challenges that we face is uh, when we want to unlock flexibility from very old buildings and also like heritage buildings for example. This becomes challenging because we don't have all the physical information, for example, information about the different materials, the different components that were used in the construction of these buildings. So it becomes quite difficult to get very accurate models about these buildings from the physical properties. So what smart to be does is to rely mostly on data-driven methods because then we can collect operation data from these buildings which we can then use to develop the building models. Another aspect uh, that we are facing is about the availability of data because we know that even in, in both old and new buildings, sensors are not installed in these buildings by default. So we don't always have enough historical data that we can use from these buildings, for example, in the building uh, modeling aspect. And even when we have this data available, we still have this issue that the users, they are concerned on who has access to this data. So what smart to be is trying to do is that we are looking at on-site edge computing where we will do on-site flexibility aggregation. So then this data remains at the level of the user and is not out of their premises.